Good Tuesday! What are we making today? Pimento, pasta eggs, butter American cheese in there, parsley, milk, paprika and onion! <laughs> today we're making a recipe from 1929 called macaroni mousse or macaroni loaf. Come on, let's face it. It looked like it might be fun. It calls for macaroni broken into two inch pieces. This macaroni I picked up at my Asian market. This is when we made our Japanese macaroni salad. And they measure about an inch and a half. It's not two inches, but I think that's pretty good. The recipe calls for one pimento. How much is that? How much is one pimento? I don't know. Soft breadcrumbs. We will grind these up. I think this time I'm going to leave the crust out. Cup and a half of milk, dash of paprika, tablespoon of chopped onion, quarter cup of melted butter, and cup and a half of grated American cheese. And we'll be using our beautiful Pyrex loaf pan. I hope it's big enough. And it gives us a chance to use our Pyrex flame or double boiler. We're going to scald the milk. And we get to use our Guardian service for boiling the pasta. They're not from 1929, but you know, Let's stop yapping and let's get cooking. says to serve it with a mushroom sauce. I mixed Campbell's cream of mushroom with a little golden mushroom and a splash of milk to get to get a nice saucy consistency. Oh man. <laughs> Craft macaroni mousse. It is moussey. Let's try it. Let's try it with our Campbell's soup gravy. You ready? This is very interesting. Here we go. Mm. 
Wow. It's noodly. It's eggy. We have to take another bite. The original picture has the curved pasta and it is totally, you get the totally curves, just like the picture. That's pretty neat. Macaroni mousse, 1929. Wow. It really is moussey. It's creamy. Wow. Oh, I like it. I like that. Noodles are soft and tender. You almost want to mush it in a bowl. How will this reheat? A bit it will be easier to cut when it's been in the fridge. Thanks for joining me this Tuesday. You know what I'm going to say? What am I going to say? Mm. Thanks for watching!